Welcome to Dana Point. This city, located at the midpoint between Los Angeles and San Diego, is almost too perfect. Beautiful beaches, bright sunshine, and a marina packed with charter boats. Once you set out on a Dana Point fishing trip, there's no telling what might happen. The sheer variety of fish, fishing grounds, and ways to cast a line offers a wide range of opportunities for anglers of all skill levels. So whether it's a blue water adventure or a peaceful day in shore, this video will cover everything you need to know. Before we dive in, make sure you're hitting those like and subscribe buttons below to keep up to date on all the latest angling videos. Dana Point is well known for the diversity of its fish species, and frankly, if we wanted to cover them all, we'd be here all day. Instead, we'll go deep into the top five species you can catch on a Dana Point fishing trip. Topping the list are yellowtail amberjack. Southern California anglers love to target these fish for a number of reasons. First of all, they taste great. Throw some fillets in the pan or enjoy a sashimi. You'll have to put some work in to get your meal on the table though. Yellowtails are predatory fish that give explosive strikes and they don't gas out easily. Battle it out with one of these fish using live bait or artificial lures anytime between April and mid-October for a guaranteed good time. To find yellowtail amberjack, you'll need to travel into deeper waters, putting you closer to the second fish on our list, tuna. The waters off of Dana Point are the summertime home to several varieties of this sought-after species. Bluefin tuna top the list, with yellowfin and albacore trailing closely behind. They're as strong as they are delicious, so get ready to roll your sleeves up if you want to reel one in. Landing in the middle of the list are white sea bass. These fish are so enigmatic that some anglers spend a lifetime trying to figure them out. Everything from the water temperature to the depth and time of day has to be just right to secure the bite. You'll also find calico bass in similar areas. These fish are much easier to hook than white sea bass. This is a great target to go after with the kids and you'll finish the day off with a tasty meal to enjoy together. And last but certainly not least are California halibut. Another family-friendly target, these fish are some of the tastiest in the inshore waters surrounding Dana Point. Most people catch them by drifting over sandy bottoms close to land, or you can even hook them from shore if you find waters deep enough. Best of all, there's a healthy supply of them year-round. Even though that concludes our top five fish species in Dana Point, there are a few more fish we can't help but mention. On your offshore trips, you can also look forward to fishing for blue and striped marlin, mahi-mahi, and even encountering massive sharks. Plus, Southern California's deep waters are home to over 60 varieties of rockfish, some of which you can target around Dana Point during their open seasons. All right, so now that you know which fish you can catch, you're probably wondering how to do so. There are two main types of fishing trips you can take in Dana Point inshore trips and offshore trips. Chartering a boat helmed by a licensed California captain is a must for offshore trips. To reach the areas that yellowtail amberjack, tuna, and marlin call home, you'll need to travel out towards Catalina and San Clemente Islands. Getting to Catalina Island from Dana Point takes about an hour and a half, depending on the kind of vessel you're on, so a full day fishing trip is recommended to make the most out of your experience. The big game action, however, takes place further out around San Clemente Island. You'll need to add about an hour of travel time to your journey, but you'll be much closer to reeling in that bluefin tuna or chasing down a striped marlin once you reach the southeasternmost tip of the island known locally as the head. If you haven't got the time for a full day trip or you'd just rather stay in calmer waters, there's still plenty to look forward to. Dana Point inshore fishing can put you on calico bass, sand bass, halibut, and more depending on the time of year. More often than not, your starting point will be the Dana Point Harbor. Here you can hop on an inshore fishing charter, rent a kayak, or even cast a line from shore. So far, we've covered the top fish species in Dana Point and how to go fishing for them. There are just a few more things to go over before you're ready to get out on the water. The first is getting a fishing license. The rules are pretty simple. Every angler over the age of 16 needs to purchase a valid California fishing license. 
This applies whether you're fishing with a licensed captain aboard a charter boat or from the shore on your own. The only time you don't need a fishing license is if you're fishing from a public pier. And that's it. You're ready to experience fishing in Dana Point. To find the fishing charter that's right for you and the trip you're planning, download the Fishing Booker app. It's available on Google Play and the App Store and allows you to browse the largest selection of fishing charters, compare prices and amenities, and book your trip fast and easy. Or check us out online at fishingbooker.com and start planning your Dana Point fishing trip today.